All right, picking Vegas and beyond. Like I was going to say at the end of that last one, before I decided to end the video. Um, shit, I forgot what I was going to say. Um, what was it? I can't remember what I was going to say. That's not good. Oh yeah, that's what it was. Um, I mentioned that it made that that after the program ended and everything, I was sick as hell for the next four or five days straight. What I was gonna say at the end of the video before I decided to end it was that. I also had severe, like I was in severe pain to the point where those three or f for three or four days straight, I was completely unable to sleep. I ended up with, like, like I said, severe pain, severe, like, just. I didn't know what was going on. Like, I was using the bathroom so many times, like, because of whatever was in that, like, the juice drinks that they had me drinking. I basically ended up with, um, Basically, I ended up having to be put on medication because I, <laughs> because of whatever the hell was in that stuff, um, I had a basically I. It caused me to go through a battle uh, with a really bad battle with hemorrhoids to the point where, like I said, I for I think it was either three or four days I had no sleep at all because of the amount of pain I was in. It got to the point I couldn't even, like, I would need to go to the bathroom. I couldn't even walk. I was crawling to the bathroom. Because of, like I said, I was having to use the bathroom way more than normal. Like, 20, 30, 40, 50 times a day. And it wasn't just making me shit more. It was making me pee more. It was making me just, like, do everything more. And... So, yeah. And then one day, like I said, I'd been in severe pain because of the hemorrhoids and... Which, I didn't even know it was hemorrhoids until I did some research. And once I found out what the problem was, I ended up with medication and was able to get through it but the thing was once I found out what it was and started the medication for it and everything else 
Then I went through the scariest damn thing you can possibly go through if you're going through that and you don't quite know for sure what you're going through. The hemorrhoids burst, which I didn't know that because this is the first and only time I've ever dealt with hemorrhoids. So the hemorrhoids like bursted, busted, however you want to say it. And Um, I go to finish my business and I just happen to look at the toilet paper it's soaked in like blood completely through the toilet paper to the point where my hand was covered in blood and I was like what the fuck and I wipe again, same thing. Soaked in blood. Soaked in blood. So, for the next two days, every time I go to the bathroom, blood everywhere. And I, at that point, I'm like, what the fuck? Am I going to die? I've never gone through that. So I go online first thing I see when I look up, you know, blood like, you know, losing a ton of blood like I was when I used the bathroom, first thing that pops up, cancer. I'm like, son of a bitch. So, yeah, I ended up scared out of my mind thinking I have fucking cancer. Because I'm losing a shit ton of blood every time I use the bathroom. Turns out, it's just hemorrhoids. Look at this, throwing fucking Pro Bowl cards in with the...